Hello, this is Rich Campy, your thinking coach. Today's grand message, I am grateful for the light and the intentional message is the trolls. The trolls. So let's talk about the trolls. Have you ever wanted to be happy, right? Like, I just wanna be happy. So how do we get there? Well, let's say that on the other side of this bridge, there's this beautiful land and it's, let's call it the Garden of Eden. It's just incredible. Everything is there and it's perfect and it's amazing. And we say, oh my gosh, if I can just get to the other side of the bridge, it'll be so awesome. So we kind of start walking up there and we get to the first part to cross over the bridge and these trolls pop out from under the bridge and they say, you may not pass the bridge until you go find me, you know, two white gems from the deepest parts of South Africa. And you must go to the deep parts of Germany and find me these rare gemstones. Once you complete those two tasks, I will let you cross the bridge. And so you go on your way and you go in search in South Africa and Germany for these precious stones. And 20, 30 years later, you get back to the front of the bridge and you say, I have found the stones, the precious pieces we are looking for. And the trolls say, you have done well, but now you must complete the second part of your task. You must go to South Florida and find me the riches at the bottom of the ocean that are gonna be fostered from these deep shipwrecks. And once you bring me those particular, partic particular <laughs> things, I will let you cross the bridge. So you go off to South Florida and you go to the shipwreck in the deepest parts of the ocean and you bring back these special treasures to the, to the trolls. And the troll says, you have done well, but you must complete the third part, right? And so the story goes on and on like that. And the key is that how often in life do we chase things that we think will bring us the riches and the happiness? cars and homes and material stuff when the reality is the riches the happiness was always within us the entire time all we had to do is cross the bridge and not get caught up with all these distraction of what we thought would be happiness right it's it's i want to get the next job i want to get the promotion i want to get this now i'm not saying those things are great if to me this is a big thing if they are part of your divine purpose part of what you're called to do, part of your higher purpose, part of what you're supposed to do, then that's all on track and it's part of your discovery. But it's a big difference between searching or finding all this stuff and thinking it's gonna make us happen. It's not gonna happen. I mean, it's, they're, they're tricks to get us to go run after all this other stuff when all we have to do is tell the trolls, troll, um, trolls that, hey, I appreciate that, but I'm just gonna cross the bridge because I can have that right now, right? That happiness comes from within by changing our focus, by our questions, by our physiology, but ultimately comes from our higher purpose, connecting with the divine power that's bigger than us, something that reaches into us and says, man, if you do this, you are on purpose. This is Coach Rich Campy saying, how will you be the first believer to cross the bridge and discover your purpose.